Hi, Joseph. Long time no see. How are you today? Ah, uh, can you hear me well? Yeah. How about can you see me? Yeah. Yes. Okay. Great. Good evening. How are you today, Joseph? Um, it was great. It was great. You're great today. Okay. How about did you go to school? Yeah, today I go to school and academy. Uh, an academy. Wow. What did you do? Did you have your PE today? No. Um, math. 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 Yeah. Uh, did you enjoy math? <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Really. Yeah. Wow. That's good. Okay. Okay. So next is hmm, how about hmm? How's the weather there today? Um. It was sunny. Sunny, and hot. Sunny and hot. Oh, I see. How about, have you already eaten your dinner? Did you already eat your dinner? Yes. Oh, what did you eat for dinner? Um, the duck meat. One more time? Duck. Duck. Duck? Urigogi? Yeah. Oh, really? Ah, yes. Okay. Do you know what? My my previous student told me that her dinner was uri, uri gogi. <laughs> the same as you. Okay, that's good. How about um hmm what did you do like last time? I I was studying. Ah uh, you you studied only, right? Uh huh. Okay, so I'll just, uh, oh, are you not ready to have your lesson for today? Yes. Uh, I'm asking you, do you like art? Do you like painting or art? Yes. Yeah, okay, so we'll relate to this one. I'll share my screen now. Okay, okay, page, let's see page. Mm -hmm. 76. Page 76. Okay. Okay. So here, let's choose. Okay. So chapter four, the arts. Okay. This performer is doing an African-Cuban dance called... Um, the rumba. She is in a famous alley called Calajon de Hamel in Havana, Cuba. So the alley is famous because Cuban artist Salvador Gonzalez has decorated it with beautiful murals and sculptures. So uh, let's choose the correct statement. Is it the rumba is a type of dance originally called uh, from Cuba or B? Ruba dancers must perform in front of the alley. Which is correct. A or B? A? A. Very good. Okay. So this one is the dancer. The Roomba dancer. Uh-huh. Okay. So let's have this colorful street art. Uh, did you hear the rain? Do you hear the rain? Can yeah. you hear the rain? You you can hear the rain? Yeah. Really? Okay. The rain? Yeah. The water? Yeah. Yeah, I can hear it. Oh, really? Wait for a while. Like. Ah, um, that only. Yeah, because. Oh, no. Oh, wait. One. The the current is not okay. Wait. Okay. So let's before you read, let's check the types of street that of art that you know. Okay. So okay. we have. 
this um do you know graffiti yeah oh how about spray paint murals like this yes i oh already learned about it um academic oh really yeah oh what should we do then should we do this still yeah we okay have to do it. Okay, yeah, we have to do that. So we have the words here. Please read. Uh, to give them an, an idea for something. Uh -huh. um, limit. Um, no, no, not limit. To give someone an idea for something? What is it? Inspire. Hmm. Is it? Is it inspire? Give someone idea for something? Okay, let's just skip that so you can think more. Okay, next, a single person. What is it? Mural. Individual, yeah. Okay, let's just cross this out so you can choose later, okay? Next is to exist or happen only in a particular place. Mm. Hmm? Limit. One more time. Limit. Limit? Yeah. Yeah. Okay. Limit. Okay, next. Not exciting or interesting. Mm. Sophisticated. No, individual. Ah, no, no, no. Individual is a single person. This is right. Mm. Inspire? Inspire, no. Oh, um, let's keep abandoned. one more abandoned no not abandoned okay to make make something beautiful beautify beautify Beaut oh no the, there's lightning here and then thunder okay. <sighs> okay next left and no longer wanted or used or needed abandoned yeah, very good. Abandoned. Next. The act um, of allowing someone to do something. Permission. Yeah, permission. Permission. Next. Highly developed and complex. Yes. Highly developed and complex. It's sophisticated. Sophisticated. Mm. Ah, mural? No. Then sophisticated. Yeah, it's it's sophisticated. How about uh number nine? I'll learn to pick their pancake on a wall. Mural. Mural, very good. A Next. group of a group of people who live in the same area or have the same interest. Community. Community. Very good. Okay, so we have how many? Not exciting. Mm, not exciting or interesting is you. It's dull. Dull. Uh, uh huh. And last is to give someone. An idea for something. Inspire. Very good. It's inspire. Oh, yeah. Teacher. But I said inspire at number one. One more? Oh, you said inspire I... number one? Yeah. I'm sorry. 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 <laughs> okay. I'm sorry about that. I thought you said... Ah, yeah. Inspire. I'm sorry about that. Okay. 
So here, let's choose the best words to fill in the blanks, okay? Okay. Did okay. you get per did you get permission before you took photos of the artwork B? What number? I what letter? B. B. Okay, very good. That is B. This house has been for two years, but now a family is moving in. Mm, sophisticated. Is it? This house has been blank for two. No, not sophisticated. Ah, abandoned. Yeah, abandoned. Being left. Right? Next. There's a beautiful new mural painted on our floor. Very good. Next, number four. The people in my community are trying to find someone to paint the theater. Very good. Very good. Okay, perfect score. Now, let's have to read this one. Your time to read. Your time to shine. All of our street art. People have been creating art since the era of humans began painting in caves over 4 million years ago. But for centuries, most art was limited to museum and galleries. Today, more and more art is being created by the people within a community. They aren't usually paid, and they often aren't even asked to create the art. Rather, individuals and community groups willingly bring their own ideas into public spaces. Mm -hmm. So here. Okay. Oh. Well, what? Okay, nothing. Now, yarn bombing. Mm. Yarn bombing. In some cities, monuments bring bridges and even forms of transportation have been yarn bombed. In this art form, people create colorful wood blocks. Then they put the cross on dull objects such as pipes and park benches. Yarn bombing bombing adds a warm feeling to the cold. Hard objects found in cities. Gorilla garden. Some some uh, people also Beautify urban areas by making gardens in abandoned areas. Some gorilla gardeners just plant, plant flowers, while others think it's best to plant crops for food. Gorilla gardening began in the UK in 2004. It is now happening in cities around the world. Gorilla gardeners don't own the land they work on. <clears throat> but they often take care of it as true they do. Graffiti. Yarn bombers and gorilla burgers don't ask permission to create their own. As a result, some people in the community get angry. Same is true for gravity artists. Many people don't like it when People paint on walls without asking. But as graffiti has become more sophisticated over the years, more and more people have begun to see it as art, not just a damage. Some building owners have been inspired to invite artists to create colorful murals on and around the, their buildings. These designs add interest and often tell the story of the people who live in the community. Street art, such as farm yarn bombing, rural log burning, and graffiti, aims to make cities more colorful, enjoyable places to live. Very good. Okay, so what? Let's go to line two. What is the hundreds of years? Hundreds of years. Line two. Hundreds um, of years, meaning? What? 
Line two, what does, what word is that, what word means hundreds of years? Um, four, line four? No. Uh, line two? Yeah, line two, line two. Hundreds of years. And centuries. Yeah, centuries. Very good. How about a way of traveling from one place to another place? Line eight, seven, eight here. Ah, six, seven, eight. This one. Transportation. Transportation. Very good. How about materials used for making clothes or sheets? Line nine. Material materials used for making clothes. Wool. Wool. Or yarn. Yarn. It's yeah, yarn. yarn. Yeah. yeah. Do, do you know yarn? Yes. Yeah. How about wool? Yes. It's yeah. a it's a, like a soft like Yeah, it's the Yarn or wool. Yeah, wool. Yeah, very good. It's wool. It's just the same as yarn. Okay, next is to make something beautiful. Line 13, 10, 11, 12, 13. To make something beautiful, it's... Beautify. Beautify. Very good. Okay, next. Um, To have something that belongs to you. To have something that belongs to you. Line 17. To have something that belongs to you. Line 70. Yeah, 17. Do you have something that belongs to you? A land? No. Do you have something that belongs own. to you? Yeah, own. Very good. Okay, next. Last. Line 26. Highly developed and complex. 26. Highly <laughs> developed. Sophisticated. Very good. Very good, Joseph. Okay, now let's have this reading comprehension. Okay, what is the passage mainly about? Uh, the passage is mainly about types of street arts created by community members. Very good. Okay, what do yarn bombers do? What do yarn bombers do? Okay. Plan what? Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Yeah, um, plant, they plant flowers in urban areas. Mm -hmm. Really? Oh. What do yarn bombers? Oh. Let's see. Those are... Do they do yeah. that? Yeah. What do they do? Mm -hmm. They put colorful wool cloth and object in sin. Yeah, okay. Which is not true. Not true about graffiti. Mm -hmm. Not true. It can tell a story. No. B. What? Letter? B. B. Yeah, it is always simple. It's not simple. It's an yeah. art. Yeah. Okay, what can be inferred from paragraph one? Mm. Paragraph one. Well, people have always been interested in creating art. Yeah, okay, very good. Next, what does it in line 16 refer to? Line 16, what does it in line 16 refer to? Very mm, elaborately. Hmm? Very elaborately. Yeah, very good. Okay, so let's answer the questions. Okay, so number okay. one, before street art, where was most art limited to? Mm. It was limited to museums and galleries. Museums 
and gallery. Gallery or galleries? Gallery. Okay, very good. Now, what is the purpose of yarn bombing? It is to add. You didn't hear the th thunder? It is to add. Mm. It's just to add warm feeling to cold heart object found in cities. Okay, very good. How about what do some building owners ask graffiti artists to do? They ask graffiti artists to. They ask graffiti artists to to draw with to 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 create colorful murals on and around their buildings. To create colorful. Murals? Yes. And ah create colorful murals. Uh, colorful murals and wait. Yes. On and and around around their building. buildings very good okay. tell me when you finish when you're finished okay okay done no oh no <laughs> i'm finished finish okay so let's do the graphic organizer lastly okay Yarn from wait. We have types of street art. We have causes and effects. So yarn yarn people people beautify um no people. Put wool cloths on new objects such as pipes and park benches. Mm -hmm. Very good. And then the, the effects. It adds a warm feeling to. Um, it adds a warm feeling to the cold hard object. Very good. Uh -huh. you're, like, you're, you're really like, gardening. People make gardens. People make gardens, gardens in abandoned uh, areas. In abandoned areas. Okay, and then it. It beautifies urban area. Yeah, it beautifies urban areas. Wait. Mm -hmm. Take your time. It 
Yes. Um, people paint on walls and the earth has become more sophisticated over the years. Sophisticated over the years. Mm -hmm. And it, last, it adds interest and often tell the story of the people who live in the community. Mm -hmm. Very good, Joseph. Yes. Okay, done. Okay, so let's complete the summary using the words here. Okay. So read and answer. Is this the last part? Yes, last part. In the streets, you. Hmm? In the what? In the. In, in the streets, you can see the art cre created by individuals within a community. Oh, really? In the streets, you can see. Um, you can see. Art. Are you sure? Yeah. No. One more time. Um. Okay. okay. Um, okay, you can see the street art we created. You can see this the art. You can see art. No. You can see street or ah, you can see the you can see art in street. Okay. Ah, oh, the street is yeah. Only one. You can see. You can see art in street. Yeah, mm -hmm. art in the streets, created by. Wait. Okay. Okay. You can see art in the street created by individuals within a community. Mm -hmm. Street artists don't always ask permission. Uh -huh. 
street artists don't always ask, ask permission for permission. permission. Um, and aren't usually paid. Street art such as yarn bombing, real reverting, and graffiti make And graffiti makes cities more colorful, enjoyable places. Okay, makes cities enjoyable you sure? Um no, no more colorful and enjoyable. More colorful enjoyable places places very good okay yarn, yeah. yarn yarn bombing is putting wool cloths on cold hard objects in cities it adds a warm feeling to them to real gardening Guerrilla gardening is making gardens in abandoned areas. Yeah, it's making gardens in oh, abandoned areas. Areas, very good. It beautifies. It, it beautifies urban areas. Graffiti is painting walls or creating murals. To add a story, I know. Um, Um, graffiti is painting walls or creating murals and tell a story to add interest. Yeah, and tell a story to add interest. Oh, Joseph is very good with this one. Very good. Okay, so you did a very, very great job with this one. Okay, so what did we talk about? We talked about three things. Um, a three kinds of street art. Um, we talked about what is the first one? Uh, yarn bomb bombing. Oh, yarn bombing. What is yarn bombing again? And you really look at me. And what is Peter, it? I can see. I you can't see. Uh, should I share my screen again? <laughs> Okay. Okay, here. Teacher, I can. Oh. Now? Can you see yeah. it now? Okay. Yeah. 
We talked about yarn bombing, yarn bombing and Doria Lavertney and, and graffiti. Yeah, what is yarn bombing all about? It's about put a wool cloth on new objects such as pipe and hair <laughs> benches to add a warm feeling to the cold and heart of. Uh, do you do that? Yarn bombing? Is that no. famous in Korea? Um, who is it? No. I know it's a no. How about gorilla gardening? Mm, uh, some particular people do it. Ah, some particular people do it. How about what is it again? And graffiti. I don't know. What is gorilla, gorilla gardening again? Um, it's to make gardens in abandoned areas. Yeah. So do you have like many abandoned areas in Korea? Mm, yeah. Oh, Some. Really? Some. And then um, are the abandoned areas in Korea like uh, really ugly or not? Some people make gardens out of it. What do you think? It is good. It's still good. Yeah. Oh, because here in the Philippines, where when there's an abandoned area, it's not really good. When you see it all uh in the way or in the road, it's not really good to see. <laughs> like they 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 just let it, you know uh be old and then they will never come back to it how about there are the abandoned areas in your country still pretty mm, not as much not as much okay how about the last one graffiti um there are some graffiti in our school oh really yes yeah, some some students bring their sprays Ah. The wow. Some Are... drawings um disappear when after rains. <laughs> but some arts doesn't and doesn't disappear. Yeah. Oh, is your principal good with that? With the graffiti? No, they um they <laughs> say it is good, but they are finding the people who draw. Ah, and then they will get mad or no? They are not mad. Oh, they're just going to find who did it. And then... Yes. Oh, really? Okay, yes, that's they, good. They draw a cat and dog. Wow. I want to see it next time. <laughs> okay, so <laughs> since it's... Uh-huh, and? And they... And they write a sentence about about our school and their appearance. Oh wow, that's good to know. Okay, or in here in the Philippines, it's not allowed to draw on the wall or anything. Yeah, they will get mad here. So anyway, since it's already time, uh, do you have any more questions? By the way, you're really no. good. You're really good at reading, answering. Very, very good, Joseph. Anyway, do you have any more questions before we end? No. No more questions? Okay, so I'll see you next week. I'll see you next time, Joseph. Okay, have a good night. Bye-bye.